Hey everybody, hope you're doing well. We're going to go back to 1976 and the debut album by the band Triumph. We're going to do the song Blinding Light Show into Moonchild. And um, this is a song that really, really, really highlights uh, Rick Emmett's uh, versatility and talent as a guitar player and a singer. Um, guitar playing is incredible. And if you hear some similarities to... Uh, what um, Iron Maiden would do later, it's understandable because it kind of has that sort of Iron Maiden-y type of feel, except um, it's a trio. And Rick Emmett plays the hell out of the guitar. So uh, anyway, let's hit it. Um, again, this is Blinding Light Show into Moonchild off of Triumph's debut album from 1976. And from where I stand, I reach my hand to catch a love blow. But the selfish stare through electric air is a blinding light show. I see the face that has no place, but somehow knows. The truth is clear, but hiding here in the blinding light show.
as we lose the candle glow. And no one knows tomorrow in the blinding light show. The blinding light show. The blinding light show. Sorry. Thunder clap. Had to hear it. 1976. What are you going to do? <clears throat> anyway. Um, wow. What a tremendous way to end your debut album. Especially back in, again, 1976. Probably didn't need the thunder strike at the end, but, you know, that's you know, whatever. 1976. That was cool, I suppose. Um, you got to forgive the album art, too. Again, 1976. Things were different back then. So three guys shirtless in some weird, I don't even know what that image is really supposed to be, but um, I guess they're not wearing silk robes like the guys in Rush did <laughs> during a particular period of time. Um, anyway, just again, tremendous musicianship. Really, really, really showcasing Rick Emmett's guitar playing too. Um, incredible. Gilmore's drumming was pretty great and you know um mike levine's bass playing also equally great so i mean it's it's again it's a hell of a way to uh finish off your debut album um, with a killer track like that so yeah sure again there are aspects of it that may be a little bit dated but you know not all music is timeless i suppose um with that said hey I appreciate you all for watching. Please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below and we can talk about it further. And uh, I wish you all well. Take care.